The value of a car dropped from $7,400 to $6,800 over the last year. What percent decrease is this? We want to see the beginning value, or note that, $7,400, to the end value, $6,800. Here we want to find what's called the absolute change. Okay, so the change between these two values. To do that, that absolute change, we start with the absolute value of our end value, so where we ended with $6,800, and we subtract our beginning value, $7,400. Now it's the absolute value, so be careful with that. That comes out to be, well, 6,800 minus 7,400 is a negative $6,000, or 600, sorry, $600. But we're taking the absolute value of that, which makes it a positive $600. So we have an absolute change of $600 between the beginning and end value here. Well, since we're starting here, we want to find the now the relative change, what percent decrease it's going, we start with the initial value. So our relative change is the uh, absolute change, $600, over our initial, our starting quantity, which is 7,400, right here. Dollar signs cancel out and we end up with a decimal value. So 600 divided by 7,400 is a 0 0.081. Let me just check that in my calculator, make sure it's correct. 600 divided by 7,400. Yep, and there is a decimal afterwards, but we only need this many places. So we'll put approximately right there. And so if I want to write this as a percent, we have a, move the decimal two spots to the right. We have an 8.1% decrease. Okay, and it's an approximate percent. So our answer here for dropping $600 on that car price, we saw an 8.1% decrease. As always, thanks for watching.